From Manly, I know you, Lynn. Hello, how are you? I'm We're fine, here. I'm here. Hello. Sorry. How are you, Lynn? <laughs> Good morning, Minister. Thank you very much for coming. Lynn Hopper right. from Manly Branch and also from Council. Um, Minister, uh, you're a senior liberal and uh, senior, sorry, you're a senior liberal and a senior liberal politician in health, so I'm sure you're aware of what's going on in New South Wales and Australia as far as health goes. Uh, you'd be aware that back in April, Mr Dutton, your federal counterpart, was reported in various business newspapers and magazines advocating the privatisation of public health. Um, and let's be honest, I, I read his quote, the coalition, the coalition, if we're elected, would continue to work with state governments that have delivered services through private hospitals and not for profits. This is surely what this really means, it's privatisation of the public health. Well, I don't in the heat does, of an actually. election, in the heat of an election, Mr Dutton is now running around trying to deny all this. Given this has major implications for the state hospitals, and I'm sure in particular that you know the Northern Beaches problems. I'm very proud of the Northern Beaches. Um, and as a senior health politician in Mr Dutton's party, are you aware of him or anyone in the federal opposition or the Liberal Party denying these comments or having these statements corrected at any time? And if they are elected in September, Will you work with Mr Dutton and Mr Abbott to continue to privatise more hospitals in New South Wales? I can't answer for Mr Dutton's comment. You say, you claim there he's denied it. I can only say that I would expect that he would be truthful in that case. So he's certainly not discussed anything with me about um, in the involvement of the private sector uh, in any of our public hospitals. And in fact, I have no intention at this stage of doing anything like that. The new Northern Beaches Hospital is just that. It's a brand new hospital on a brand new greenfield site. Um, it will provide public patient care in a greater number and capacities than the two hospitals that uh, it replaces. Uh, there's been a widespread support for it, um, involving both the private sector and the public um, sector. It will be part of New South Wales, uh, sorry, Northern Sydney Local Health District Clinical Service Planning and uh, the staff who are working at both at Manly and Mona Vale have all been guaranteed that their jobs, they will have jobs. Only and then I know years. your background um, in relation to your complaints about um, the coalition on the Northern Beaches. But the truth of the matter is people have welcomed this hospital, nurses, many of them, the clinicians, and there's been widespread support for it. Mm, um, I disagree Thanks. with the widespread support for it, Minister. I think you'll find there's widespread support not for the private hospital. Uh, we're very happy for a new Level 5 public hospital, but the last thing we need on the Northern Beaches is more private beds. Just as a finish off, did you... There are no private beds to speak of on the Northern Beaches. Just to finish that off, in the Northern Sydney Local Health District, we actually have the highest percentage of private beds in the whole of the state. 45% of the beds in the, Northern, in the Northern Sydney Local Health District, 45% of those beds are private. That is the highest amount of private beds in the whole of the state. So the last thing we need on the Northern Beaches is more private beds. Thank can you, I, Lynn. Thank you, Minister. Can, can I just explain to people that... Um, the, new, the, the people of the Northern Beaches do not have direct access to a private hospital. In fact, 40% of those treated in the public hospitals, Manly and Mona Vale, were being treated as private hospital patients. So this is a way of freeing up some of those beds that were currently being occupied by private patients now for public patients. Thank you very much, Lynn. Thank you. Fiona, I'll invite uh, Fiona Deegan. Uh, Duggan, sorry, uh, from Manavar. All this side. Thank you, this side. Thanks, Fiona. Good morning, Minister. Fiona Hello, Deegan, Monavale Public Hospital. Hello, can, you, can you, Minister, guarantee a private operator of your proposed new Northern Beaches Hospital have the same nursing hour system applied in the same way as existing public hospitals of the same peer group and ward types, not for two to five years, but forever? Um, the outline of our commitment to um, staffing was made at the announcement of the expressions of interest request, and that would be that we would require the um, new operator to, to employ the star existing st offer employment to the existing staff on their current positions without interview uh, for a period of five years with all award and salary uh, provisions intact. For five years. For five years. Thank you.